Is this working? Oh my god. Okay, I think this is working now. You guys, what the hell is going on with Facebook? So annoying. What's up, everybody? When you're here, toss up some hearts, comment below, let me know where you're tuning in from. Let me know if you're here on the replay, if there's not the little red live button here. What's up, Taylor? What's up, Angela? You guys, day two of Halloween scary makeup. I know, Angela. Hey, Allison. Hey, Chelsea. You guys, last night, Angela was at the party that I was at, and we had so much fun together. It was a blast. Um, so, yeah. Hey, Cassie. Hey, Jackie. So I'm going to share this to a couple places while you guys are all logging in. Thanks, Allison. I was so nervous yesterday. Like, I was cranky from a nap. Um, which, by the way, I totally slept in my contacts last night. So my eyes are out of control. Hey, Alyssa. Hey, Andrea. Um, I was so nervous that it wasn't going to turn out very well. And it turned out decent. It was, like, it was my first time. Like, come on, you know. So it wasn't, like, amazing. It wasn't, like, the best thing I've ever seen. But... Hey Veronica, hey Lindsay, I definitely need more practice, um, but I think it turned out fairly decent. Hey Erica, hey Hannah, you guys when you're here make sure you're putting a comment below saying hi so I know that I can see your comments. Um, hopefully I don't miss any today. Hey Katie, hey Savannah. So today we're going to be using liquid latex on my face. I get that people do this all the time, but I'm not one of those people. Hey, Kristen. Hey, Erica. Um, I'm not one of those people. <laughs> so I'm like, oh my God, this could be a total shit show. And so I'm wearing like, this jacket doesn't even fit me very good, but it's freezing in my house. And I'm just wearing like this old shirt that I don't really care about because I don't want it to drip on anything. Hey, Amanda. Hey, Bailey. Um, this is the latex that I have and it's really like liquidy. So, we're just going to go for it. Yeah, Hannah, it definitely is crazy. Hey, Miriam. Hey, Cassie. Oh, awesome. Hey, Carrie. I'm like, I'm really nervous, you guys. I'm really, really nervous. Um, okay, so please, please share this video, too. I want to try to see. We had a decent crowd on last night for the fact that I, um, actually, Elton, it wasn't too bad. I don't have any breakouts this morning. I washed it off as soon as I got home. It felt funny when I was putting it on. It was definitely like not like the normal, typical makeup feel because it's not normal, typical makeup. Um, Andrew said, I've used it before. If you use toilet paper and coat it with a liquid latex and fake blood, you can make pretty sweet fake wounds. Yes, girl. And, and cotton balls. You girls prepared. So... We're just going to go for it. We're just going to try it. I got these little scissors too to like cut into it because I want to make them look like it was like carved into my face. Like that's the goal. I'm not really trying to like recreate anybody else's look. I'm using again that crispy um, picture just to go off of something. But I'm not really trying to like mimic anyone else's look. So and because I used this stuff last night, um, not the liquid latex, but this really shitty base and I'm going to use it again. I brought in some oil today to mix with this to try to make it easier to apply on my skin because I felt like yesterday this was so freaking thick that it was like really patchy and I mean I guess it's not that big of a deal because if you've seen the movie It, his skin looks like shit anyway. It's not like perfectly white porcelain like the original. It's like really like nasty looking so whatever but I just wanted it to apply smoother. So again, Please share this video. I want to see how many people we can get on live today. I was really surprised with the crowd that we had yesterday, considering that it was pretty quiet. The Well, not totally quiet, but I had to get like really into it, and I feel like today especially, I'm going to have to get really into it. So I apologize. I can't have music because you guys know Facebook sucks, and they'll put me in Facebook jail. But I really want to see who all we can get on here, like hanging out with us, and who knows, maybe there's somebody out there who knows how to do something better than I can and can teach me because this is the first time that I've used liquid latex on my face. I only practiced it on my hand the other day with that fake wound that I made. That was the first time I've ever even used it. So we're going to be using that along with fake blood and really trying to make an even scarier look today than we did yesterday. So, okay, I'm going to start off with a good 
primer. This is my unique um, Touch Glorious. Thanks, Nicole. Hey, Haley. I'm so, I'm nervous again today, you guys. I should have brought a drink in here with me. Is it too early to start drinking? It's only three in the afternoon. <laughs> I need, I need a glass of wine or something. And so I cleaned my whole glam room the other day and it's already a shit show again. Um, so yeah, definitely tomorrow is going to be like a day of cleaning and resting and catching up on everything because I've been so on the go. Um, I still don't have a glue stick for my eyebrows either, so we're going to have to fight through hiding them again. And I noticed yesterday too, um, yeah, Andrea, it was so good to see you last night too and hang out with you. Yeah, we're going to another party. Um, <laughs> awesome, Chelsea. I need one. Actually, okay, so tonight's party is a little bit more low-key. Um, well, afterwards we'll probably hang out with my parents and have a good time, but... Um, I'm going to have to definitely wear a tank top too. I don't know. I'm going to let this sit for a second and I'll just chat with you guys before we get into it. Um, but I don't know if you guys saw my pictures from last night or not, but um, my costume's a little booby. So tonight we're going to be around children and I don't feel comfortable with that. Like literally my whole boob, um, whatever, this is TMI, sorry, but my whole boob didn't even fit into like the boob section of the uh, costume because I got a medium and I should have gotten a large and I was like busting out of this thing you guys like literally I'm not even joking I was standing there talking and one of the buttons just went boop and like popped right off like it was intense um so tonight I'm gonna be wearing a tank top underneath that and obviously still my leggings because it's really cold out um so I'm gonna make this like kid friendly but I'm still gonna make it really scary and I'm probably going to um, do the spray in my hair to make my hair a different color tonight because I didn't have enough time last night so we're just gonna try to go for it um, I'm really excited I'm really nervous so let's see yeah we had a good time oh what are we doing tonight okay that's what I was gonna tell you guys so tonight and I kind of explained this last night but if you weren't tuned in for the video last night um, by the way, I'm using chapstick because I don't have glue on my eyebrows. So, um, oh my God, I was so cold I couldn't wear leggings. You couldn't wear leggings, Andrea? You should have. That's why you were so cold. Um, so the party that we're doing tonight, um, I explained yesterday, but I will explain it again. Um, my friend, my dad's friend for a long time, for like years, um, has a daughter who has an illness. I don't know exactly what it is, so I can't tell you. But I know that she's in a wheelchair. She's 13 years old. Um, she's overcome a lot of things already in her young life. And so they were over at my parents' house one day. And she's so cute. And she was like telling my dad, because they have like a barn out back. They live in the country. And um, she was saying to my dad, oh, it would be so cool to have like a haunted house out here. And so he was like, um, you know, would you want to have a haunted house out here like with your friends? And she was like, yeah. So... We decided to host this haunted house for this little girl with this illness and all of her friends and they're like 12, 13-ish age. And she wanted us all to dress up scary so we could scare them in the haunted house or whatever. I don't even know the whole setup out there. So Kyle and I are dressing up scary and we're, well, he's going to be Georgie so it won't be too scary. But we're going to dress up scary and go out there and then my aunt and uncle are coming as well and they're going to dress up spooky and my parents are dressing up spooky and actually the little girl picked out my parents costumes she wanted them to be a, a devil or whatever so my mom's going to be a lady devil and my dad's going to be the devil or whatever and um yeah so and my brother and his girlfriend and all that like our whole family is just kind of like coming together and we're like throwing this big Halloween party for this little 13 year old girl and gonna try to spook her friends out so it's definitely more like kid approved tonight it's not gonna be like an adult party at least until after they leave then we'll probably all like hang out but I'm really excited I'm super super excited for it um, I'm gonna add a little bit more of this so yeah Okay, I'm going to pull this video up too because yesterday I stopped seeing comments. So I just want to make sure that I don't miss out on anything. Hey, Hillary. Thanks, Natalie. Thank a thanks, Allison. Yeah, fleece line leggings, Jessica. Oh, and yeah, Andrew, your knee-high socks. My birthday is on Halloween. Let me know if there are any parties that day so I have something to do. You know what sucks is that Halloween is on a Tuesday. So there's probably not going to be anything in all honesty. Um... 
That's so fun that your birthday's on Halloween, though. That's really cool. You could always celebrate early or after. My birthday's on March 1st, which is, like, probably the most boring birthday day ever. Um, because it's always, there's always still snow on the ground. Like, there's nothing going on. I wish that I had, like, a summer birthday so at least we could go out somewhere and enjoy ourselves. Okay. So now that I've let this primer sit on my skin a little bit and I've waxed down my um, brows to the best of my ability since I don't have glue here. Um, hey Hope, hey Laura. I'm just gonna take a couple drops of this. I'm using, this is rose hip oil. I use this on my face usually at night. But I'm gonna take a couple drops of this and I'm gonna mix this into this face product here that I used last night as my base. Um, and hopefully that'll help it apply a little bit smoother on my skin. Because last night it was really hard to work with. It was so thick and nasty. So we're just, yeah, I feel like that applies way smoother like that. It's still thick, but it's going to even itself out. For my winter babies, we usually go to the water park. Ooh, that's fun, Lauren. We usually end up going up to Traverse City, which I love for my birthday, and we do like wine tasting. We've done that basically every year. I don't think that we did it last year, but we've done it every other year. What did we do on my birthday last year? I don't even remember. You know what I've always wanted? I have always wanted a surprise birthday party. Okay, so I had a surprise birthday party once. Um, my B-Day is two days after Christmas, and that's pretty annoying. Oh, Allison, that sucks. Hey, Brooke. Um, I had a surprise birthday party once, but I found out about it before the actual day, and it was my best friend that was throwing it for me, so then I just ended up helping her basically plan my own surprise birthday party. <laughs> So I've always wanted a surprise birthday party. And that's like something that you can't ask for a surprise birthday party, right? Hey, Jenna, um, you have to want, you have to have someone that wants to do it for you. So I'm always secretly hoping every year that someone will surprise me with a surprise birthday party. Because I feel like I always get gypped on my birthday because, again, it's snow out. Nobody wants to do anything. It's always during wrestling season for Kyle, so he's like busy with state championship crap, and I just get the short end of the stick for my birthday. Hey, Steven. Hey, Lauren. Sorry if I missed anybody. Make sure you're commenting below when you get here, please, and feel free to share this video. I'm going to continue to add some of this oil to this face base makeup here. So are you guys doing anything fun tonight for Halloween since Halloween's on Tuesday and that's super lame and who goes out on a Tuesday other than Drake, right? Club on a Tuesday. Do you guys like that song? Hey Lex, what's up? Hey Hannah. Sorry if I'm missing anybody. Actually, I'm going to go over my lips today with this. Hey Kayla. Hey Henley. Staying home and watching Stranger Things. Andrea, okay, so I got home last night and I was going to, keeping the tip of my nose open with this. Hey, Mariah, I was going to start that and I turned it on on my iPad, my new iPad that I'm so happy about, um, and I fell asleep within like two seconds. So I just had to stop it. I was like, I have to be focused. I can't miss out on anything. So I'll probably watch it. Depending on what happens tonight, I might watch it tonight. If not tonight, definitely tomorrow. I'll be watching it tomorrow while I catch up on laundry and do all the fun Sunday things. You need to make more makeup videos. You are great at it. Oh, thank you. Oh, hi, Charlie. I hope I'm not missing out on any here. Hold on, I think I need to open... It's so weird. Like, I'm seeing all the comments here today, but not on my laptop. And it just concerns me, because yesterday the comments, like, stopped on my video. But we'll see. I guess I'll just leave it here. What else? It's working for now. Hey, Tana. So, yeah, today 
I'm really going to try to, because I'm using that liquid latex, I really want to make those lines that he has look like they're cuts on my face, like really deep cuts. So that's why I want to use the liquid latex. I also, when I was looking at myself last night and the pictures and stuff, I feel like my eyebrows need to be a little higher. Like not too high, but a little bit higher. They were a little too regular, um, if that makes any sense for him because I feel like even though he in the movie doesn't really have any eyebrows they're literally just like cuts like in his skin there is no eyebrow but I think they need to be a little bit more arched I guess so that's one thing I'm going to change today too Charlie just asked why your makeup didn't match your face she's getting too smart for almost five I had to explain to her you're putting Holly makeup on that's awesome look at her little makeup girl that's one thing that like I am you guys, I'm not even joking. You think you see a lot of me now? Wait until I have kids because I can't wait to make makeup videos with my kids. Like I have so many friends that have kids and I'm like, why aren't you doing cute little videos with them? Like I, I love that Kayla does that. She's gotten her daughter on there to help her do her makeup before, but I feel like I'm going to want to do that all the time. I think it's the cutest thing and I just can't wait one day for me to have a daughter or a son who wants to be silly with me and make makeup videos and do fun things like that. I had such a great childhood with my mom. She was always like wanting to play like Barbies or like do, I don't know, all that fun stuff with me. And I just feel like it made my childhood so fun. And she always tells me how much fun she had, like even though she was an adult, like it just brought her back to her childhood. Makeup videos together, I mean, not having more kids, Kayla says. You done with the kid train, Kayla? <laughs> hey, Lacey. Cassie says boys are better. <laughs> Her cookies are the best. They are. When did you have my mom's cookies, Natalie? They are the best. My mom has her own secret recipe for chocolate chip cookies that she makes. And um, they're amazing. And I'm not just saying that because she's my mom. Like, anytime she takes them to a party, like, they're one of the first things to go. There will be no leftovers. I feel like I'm covering the brows better today, too. Hey, Lexi. I'm just not going to be afraid to pack it on today. Just going to pack it all on there. Because it really wasn't that bad to take off yesterday, in all honesty. I thought it was going to be a lot worse. Hey, Caitlin. You guys, when you're here, please comment below and say hi. Oh, you stopped over with Ashley? Oh, awesome. So you've seen my house. Sweet. Wow, they're really disappearing today, you guys. This is creepy. Yay, Emily. I'm so glad that you're here. Oh, now it's starting to get thicker because I don't have that, um, that oil on there to thin it out. I'm going to add a little bit of oil because I don't want it to be <laughs> too crazy. Hey, Dakota. Hey, Brittany. Put this on the brush and add a couple drops to my face. I see Kelsey, Whitney, Vanessa. Comment below when you're here, guys. I try to say hi to everybody. It looks so crazy with no eyebrows. I know, right? What if, like, okay, you know how there's always, like, beauty trends, right? What if in the future, no eyebrows becomes a trend and everybody just, like, starts shaving all their eyebrows off but, like, not repenciling anything in? Wouldn't that be crazy? Hey Janelle, hey Liz. <laughs> I know, wouldn't that be awful? Hey Carrie. You guys, I have the worst hairline. Look at that shit. I have my dad's hairline. 
<laughs> yeah, caveman stuff. So Kyle and I were almost um, Gomez and is it Elvira? Is that her name? That would be so crazy. I couldn't handle it. I heard long nose hairs. Are, they are not. You know, okay, let me just say something, all right? So you guys all see those videos about, oh, new trend, um, like the squiggle eyebrows and the whatever. You guys, I hope you don't believe that. You know that's not real. Morticia, that's her name. You're right, Miriam. That stuff is not real. People just post it for the shock factor because it gets them more views. Like, hashtag fake news. There's no way that that's real. No one thinks that looks good. I don't care how, like, fashion forward you are. <laughs> no. Yes, Morticia. We almost were Morticia and Gomez this year, which will probably be next year because I feel she, sh she shaved her brows off when she was, like, 12. Oh, my God. Thanks, Lacey. Yeah, no, it's definitely not a trend. Um, you guys want to hear, I should try to find an old picture of my eyebrows from when I was like in middle school. So this was back when my cousins lived in Missouri and we would go on family trips. And um, we went down there and I remember I wanted my mom to pluck my eyebrows. Um, oh, you're being Wednesday this year? Awesome, Alexandra, that's so cool. Um, so anyway, I wanted my mom to pluck my eyebrows. Well, she was busy and she was like, I'll get to it later. And I was just being a little impatient biatch. So I got them out myself and I plucked my own eyebrows and I plucked them so thin. And one of them was like, woo, like went way up. And, um, it was not good. It was not good. And there's like whole, all the pictures of me during our family, uh, um, vacation. <laughs> With my eyebrows like all jacked. Like it looked like one eyebrow. I was just like super surprised the whole time. So. Okay. So I think we got a good base going right now. What do you guys think? I think I hid the brows a lot better today than I did yesterday. Um, I'm still going to need to. I need to set these because I still in real life can see these more than what's popping up on camera. For sure. So. We're going to. Um. Oh, I wonder, I don't know if this will work, but thanks, Martin. Yeah, I, I thought it would be good. I used to have really long hair, but I cut it recently, so I was like, I could always get, um, I could always get a wig, but Kyle would be the perfect Gomez if he shaved his beard off and had his little, um, mustache. I'm like wondering if I can put, I don't know how this is going to work though, but I was going to say like cut a slice of this and stick it to that paint and go over it. Maybe that'll be too much. That's going to be too much because I want to draw my, I'm not going to do it, just kidding. Because I want to draw my brow on over it. It was okay when I drew the brow on over it. You couldn't really tell. So we're going to powder my face real quick before we get into anything else. What did we use yesterday? We used this brush because I don't really care for it. I'm trying to think if there's any other... Oh, I did take this, though, this Morphe palette. I'm going to add this white over my brows real quick, too. Remember this white that we used, this little white in here? You guys, make sure you're commenting below as you um, hop on here with me. Because I'm just afraid that the comments are going to go away again. Just a little extra. The trick is walk in long tight gown like Morticia. Yeah, she's got that long pretty black gown. Hey Rebecca, hey Becca. Don't shave his beard, he looks very, <laughs> I know Julie, I love his beard, I absolutely love it, but honestly, it grows back pretty fast. So that's why I would be okay with him doing it for Halloween, because it does grow back decently fast. But I'd only let him shave it for Halloween, that's it. I planned on being a deer so my boyfriend can just wear his usual clothes. He was no help in deciding. Then, of course, today he wants to shop for costumes at last minute. We are going to a party tonight. So fun. Hey, Chelsea. Okay. This looks so crazy. So crazy, girls. <sighs> but... 
now that I'm trying this out this year, like next year I can be better prepared and get some more makeup that will just make it even better, right? I'm just so used to doing like normal, like pretty glam makeup that I've just never, I don't know. I just never tried this. I guess I've always been intimidated. Did you see my friend Travis's mustache last night? I thought it was fake at first and died when I, <gasps> his was? I know who you're talking about. The one that was dressed up as the same um, cartoon show as Abby, right? I hope he picks something where I have to put makeup on his face. <laughs> totally. Do it. Do it and then go live while you're doing it. Because I want to see it. Um, but yeah, I've always been intimidated to do scary Halloween makeup. I don't know why. That's so funny, Andrea. I can't believe that was his real mustache. That was impressive. That was thick. That was like caterpillar level. I felt so bad that I didn't recognize your husband at first, Andrea, when I just met him the other day. <laughs> I'm so bad with stuff like that. Or there'll be people that will come up to me, um, like in public, who recognize me from Facebook or something, and like, like I would know them on Facebook, but I don't know them in real life. Does that make any sense? Like I don't recognize them. Like it takes me a second. So I always feel so bad. I feel like the biggest jerk because I'm like, oh my God, they totally know who I am and I have no idea who they are. Dude, it looked like a legit cliche mustache. It did. <laughs> That's so funny. Oh, see this brush? I'm glad I'm using this brush. I'll save it for Halloween stuff, um, but I'm not using it for anything else. It sheds. You guys can't even see that, but there's like a little, there's a little hair on me. I'm trying to find these scissors now. It's so white. <laughs> it's kind of like this setting powder is like yellow, which is really irritating that I don't have like a full on white whatever, but... We're gonna go with it. It worked last night. Hey, Abby. Hey, Bonnie, Kaylee, Kenna. I hope I'm not missing anybody. Make sure you're commenting below when you tune in and please share this video or invite friends. There's an option too where you can invite someone to watch a live. Should be at the bottom of your screen. So invite all your friends, you guys. Let's hang out. I think the fact that I cover my lips today too makes it even more intense. I feel like I saw you in Saginaw a few weeks ago. Maven bun and look like our shirts, but but I wasn't sure. Oh well, very quick in passing. Possibly, you could have. Round two. Kenna, I'm gonna be um the it or I was last night and tonight I'm gonna be the clown from it, Pennywise, but a girl version. So it's the first time I've ever been anything scary my whole life. Even as a kid, I never was anything scary. I was always like a princess or a, I, one time I dressed up as like a girl from a hula girl. Is that what they're called? That's not the proper term. But you know, like someone from Hawaii that has like the grass skirt and they like hula dance. I was one of those. I was always like the typical like girly girl. I want to be Barbie. <laughs> hey, Shelby. Hey Adela, Joanna, Lily, Heather, just checking in for a bit. This is so much more interesting than tax class, Bonnie says. Sweet, I'm glad I could give you a little break. I was a sumo wrestler once. Oh my god, Abby. That's so funny. I love it. The um, costume that I posted today from like five years ago on my personal page, if you guys follow me there, I don't know, but um, I was a Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle girl version. So I was Raphael uh, with like a skirt and everything in the turtle backpack. It was pretty cool. <laughs> That's so funny. You gotta find me pictures of that. I wanna see that, Abby. I feel like my nose here needs to be a little more white. Just here though, I'm not doing anything at the tip of my nose because that's where all the red's gonna go. 
the red and the black. Oh, it sounds like Kyle's home. Hey, Uncle Boone, what's up? You guys, Dan Ogle's my uncle. We call him Uncle Boone. Are you guys coming over to my parents' house tonight? You want to see me like this in real life? Hey, Carly. Hey, Whitney. Hey, girl, I missed the live so much. I didn't get any good service when I was at school and no internet. Darn, Shelby. Well, I'm glad that you're here now. Hey, Kimberly. Oh, yep. Oh, Uncle Boone, you're coming over tonight. Awesome. Kyle was asking last night, too. I didn't know who all was going to be coming over. Thanks, Joanna. What was I asking? Huh? What did you say I was asking? I'm on live. I'm not talking to you. What, what are you talking about? You said Kyle was asking about something. Oh, yeah. yeah. Uh, Uncle Boone and Aunt Shelly are coming over oh, tonight. Sweet. So he's on my live right now watching me. <laughs> sweet. Is it, how is it looking so far? Did I cover my brows a little bit better than last night? Mm -hmm. I feel like um, I feel like I did. I always wanted to be witches almost every year. It was my thing. I don't know why. <laughs> That's funny. I've never been a witch, actually, surprisingly. Maybe one year. Kristen says hi. I don't have a glue stick, Abby. I don't have a glue stick. Oh, it's telling me on my screen that my live is interrupted. Is everything good on your guys' end? Yes, I'm done with my classes and I graduate on the 27th of January, so I am a CMA. Awesome, congratulations, Shelby. That's a huge accomplishment. Hey, Tay, hey, Molly, hey, Shelby. Yeah, I wish I had a glue stick. I should have next year. I'll be prepared. Okay, so now that we've set this, now we can get into like the scary part. I'm starting to sweat. I'm pitting out, you guys. Ooh, look at how much I glow glowing and again I realize my my neck doesn't match um I'm gonna be wearing a tank top tonight so it's not gonna be as booby <laughs> hey Nicole um but I'm probably gonna bring stuff down like my neck I thought you looked spooky last night can't wait to see if tonight is even scary by the way you are so patient with the process interrupted on my end too darn it I hope that it's not is it back to good now it's blurry keeps going on and off okay at the moment you guys, I don't want it to do this. Is it blurry? It's blurry on my computer screen too. Kept going in and out for a second. Now it's just a little fuzzy. Started happening when Kyle slammed doors. <laughs> hey Amber. What's up, girl? You guys keep filming me in on like where it's at. If it's if it's blurry, if it's good to go, if it's cutting in and out. Darn it. I don't want to have to start this over. We're just gonna go with it, okay? We're gonna go with it and we're gonna hope that. It's good now, says Miriam. I'd love to see your makeup in a black light. It's better on my phone, says Shelby. So it might be where you guys are tuned in from. Okay, we're just going to keep going with it. So if anything happens, though, please, like, communicate with me, guys, if it starts, like, cutting in and out. If it gets to where it's too blurry, where you literally can't see anything at all, then obviously we might have to start this over. But if it's a little bit blurry, we're just going to deal with it. We're going to trust the process. Kaylee says it's good. It's good now. Sweet. Okay. Oh my god, I'm scared. Okay, so now we're going to start using the liquid latex, you guys. Or maybe, no, I should put my brows on first. Yeah, I'm going to put my brows on first, then we'll start with the liquid latex. I'm going to do anything to put this, this off because I'm so scared. It's not blurry at all on my phone, just sometimes you think it's live, but it'll jump a few seconds ahead to what you're actually saying live. Okay. Yeah, Facebook is like really touchy lately. I don't know what their deal is. I'm really nervous too because like sometimes I'll do a live and it'll be like over an hour long and then when the replay posts it's like 15 minutes so it like cuts it off. So I'm like please God I hope it doesn't do it to one of these. It gl glitches but maybe it's because Halloween is almost here. That's funny Shelby. Okay so I'm going to do my brows first then we're going to go in with the cuts. I'm going to line it again like I did last night and then go over the line with the latex. Do you see the Polaroids I posted from last night? No, I didn't, but I need to. I need to. Okay. So. You think that's a good arch? Your 
think we should bring this up a little bit. Eh? Good arch? No? That's good? I don't know if I liked what I just did there. He's so loud. Can you guys see? He's in the shower right now. Looks sinister. Yes. I love it. Uh, Amber, tonight we are going to, for those of you who are just tuning in, and bigger brows, Mariah. Um, we are hosting a Halloween party for my dad's friend's daughter. She has an illness. She is 13 and she is in a wheelchair and she wanted to have a haunted house and my parents have a barn so we decided to offer a space for her and her friends to come and host a haunted house for her. So my whole family is dressing up spooky and we're going to freak the kids out. <laughs> More arch Mariah. Oh damn. I don't know if I can. I think we're stuck like this. I think we're stuck. I don't know if I like that though. It doesn't look, I don't know. Let's try this one. I might have, I, cause I don't want to like wipe it all off cause then I'm going to have to, I'm going to screw up my face makeup. Can't tell if that's my eyebrow hair or if that's a hair from the brush that I was using. Hopefully it's from the brush. Because I'm snipping it off. Yeah, it was from the brush. <laughs> hey Emily. Hey Emma, Marissa, comment below as you guys are tuning in. It's so hard to make them even, guys. I hope that they look semi-even. Thanks, Mary. Hey, Rochelle. Hey, Michaela. Now I'm, I'm scared because we are going to start. I need a clown look for tonight, so this is great. Awesome, Tay. I hope this helps. Um, now we're going to start with the, I think we're decent on the brows for now. Whatever. If I decide to change anything on them, do you guys think they're okay? What if I wear my brows like this all the time? <laughs> Would you guys take beauty advice from me? Hey, Sarah. Shelby, I have no idea. Casey's actually not going to be there because she has to work and then she's going to some other thing. So, you can hear the shower now. <laughs> yeah, it's like right there. Like our room's, well, this room is here and then there's a shower and then our room is down the hall. Um, okay, so now we're going to start with the liquid latex. No, we're mapping it out first. See, I keep just like coming up with excuses so I don't have to, but I got to draw on the line 
of where I want those cuts to be and then we're gonna go over it with the liquid latex and I'm freaked out. Hey John. <clears throat> okay, so we're just gonna we're just gonna go for it. We're gonna take the same I used Unique's um, primal lip liner last night to kind of map out where the lines would be so I can just kind of follow along that. So yeah, I guess we'll just get into it. What did you thin the makeup with to make it go on smoother? I used this rose hip oil. This is something that I use actually in my nighttime routine. Um, it's super moisturizing, really good for your skin. But yesterday I didn't use anything and so it was really hard to like make it go on more evenly. So I'm really glad that I utilized this today because I think it helped a lot. Um, and it was good that, um, you know, I tried it yesterday first and then learned a couple things. So, all right. So it kind of is like, oops, took some black from my brow up on that part. You guys can't even see me drawing it. I'm glowing so much. Don't worry. You'll be able to see it in a bit. And I need to put black up there anyway, so it's not that big of a deal. Alright, so we got that in there. Hey Rachel. I feel like this one's up a little bit higher. Okay, so we got that there. Then under here, she's got, actually I feel like I need to put this white in here a little bit more. Hey Samantha, hey Alexis, Nikki, I don't know who else I missed, sorry guys, trying to keep up on it. Alright, so actually I'm going to wipe this off so I make sure, I try to get it as red as possible. What's up? You guys tell me about your Halloween plans. Tell me where you guys are going. What you are doing. I wish I had color contacts. Next year I'll have color contacts because that would make it even more spooky. Okay, I had to pull up her picture in another spot. Okay. So, I'm going to do something a little different tonight, too. Since I covered my lips in white, I'm going to, like, create different shaped lips. I'm not just going to go off of my own lips. Awesome. What are you doing in Utica? <laughs> hey, Ricky. So I'm definitely overlining the lip right now. Oh my god, that brush, you guys, sheds so bad. It's like little hairs all over me.
This is so cool to see compared to your usual makeup lives. I love them all though. Thank you. Going trick or treating, Mary? That's awesome. Hey, Anna. The white face and red under the eye makes your eye color pop. Thanks, Kelsey. Hey, Cassie. It looks even more intense when the rest of the um, eye makeup is on too. Oh, this is so annoying. If you guys could see these little freaking hairs. There's like a... Ah, yes, that's what I need. I need some... Jeez, I can open this. I need some tweezers. Take these little brush hairs off. There we go. Okay. Better. I really want like this whole area here to look like a wound. I'm probably gonna put some of that liquid latex like in like by my mouth. Maybe you should shave your beard, girl. I know, right? I know. FYI, that was not me plucking hair off my face. That was the um this amazing brush. <laughs> hey Lana. Okay, so now we're going with this eye. And I'm just kind of being messy with this, you guys, because we're going to, like, smudge it all together anyway in the end, if you guys missed my live from yesterday. Hey, Kelsey. Hey, Lindsay. kind of like gonna pull this out because I, I really want it to look like super creepy oh Ashley says hey see I'm missing I think I'm starting to miss comments now so please comment below when you tune in so I can see if it's popping up on my screen I gotta get a holder for my new iPad so I can use my iPad when I go live and maybe be able to see it better instead of my just my phone We're just going to fill in these lips too while we're at it. We're just going to make this look super cray right now. I'm so into this, says Kristen. <laughs> hey, Autumn. Excuse me. I wish I had some wine. I drank it all though. We don't have any more. And I'm like really overlining my lips, you guys. If you couldn't tell. <laughs> okay. So. Now that I have it outlined, now we're getting to the latex. <laughs> what are you being for Halloween? Autumn says, I am being, I actually did this look last night, but I'm doing it a little different today. I'm being um, Pennywise, the clown from It, but like a girl version. <laughs> I know, Lindsay. I actually, hey babe. 
Kyle? Kyle? What? Can you um bring a drink in here for me, please? What? A drink in here for me, please? What? Yeah, that's fine. It doesn't have to be an alcoholic one. <laughs> Oh wow, we got like 80 people on here now. You guys, make sure you're commenting below letting me know that you're here so I can see your comment and say hi. Thanks, Autumn. Okay, so now we're getting into the hard part. And this is the part that I'm like really scared about. <laughs> because I am not, I've never done this before. Sure. So. Oh, I can't catch, baby. There's too much stuff. Thank you. Love you. It's too messy. Hey Candace. Hey Katie. We got 95 people on here. You guys, 96. It keeps going up. I think this is the most I've ever had. No, I'm just kidding. Now 105. I think oh, we beat this one other time when Jamie and Angela were over. Okay. I gotta figure out what brush I'm gonna use for this because we're gonna apply this latex now over these areas. So keep sharing, you guys. Keep commenting as you um get here oh where did that other one go hold on sorry guys i think these are just some cheapo brushes that i got off amazon so i think i'm going to use these to apply this so we're just going to go for it okay we're just going to do it there is no good time um be sure to do another video of you dancing <laughs> like pennywise i will <laughs> thanks Brittany. do you like it this is like my typical like date night look, so. <laughs> All right, you guys. Let's let's do it. We're gonna start. We're gonna start doing it. Um, I am gonna cut some toilet paper first in like lines. Um, you guys, I'm so freaked out right now. Has anyone else? used latex before for a Halloween makeup look. Um, let me know. Hey Cassie, I see that you tuned in. I'm just cutting these up in some lines right now to lay my base, okay? For where these lines are drawn. And it's okay if it's a little messy because it's supposed to look like an open wound anyway, so it doesn't really matter. Andrea, you've used it before. What looks have you made with it? You'll do great. You did a great job the other day on your hand. Thanks, Candace. And Andrea, what kind of latex do you get? Someone told me the other day that you should only get like high quality latex for your face. <laughs> and I was like, oh, well, that didn't happen. A few years ago, my husband and I were Chucky and his bride. I used liquid latex and toilet paper to make his face look like Chucky. That's awesome. Yes, it's beautiful. Spread my joy. My fiance is sick and he's asleep, so I'm watching videos on Facebook. Oh, I'm sorry, Brittany, that your fiance is sick. That sucks. I hope he gets feeling better soon. But I'm glad that you're here. I'm glad that you're watching and hanging out with us. You guys, if it's your first time here too on um, my page, make sure you comment below and let me know because I like to try to say hi to everybody. Okay, so I've cut these up in little strips. Um, zombie, Pennywise, yep, Ashton, this is gonna be Pennywise, like a girl version, so. Okay, here we go, we're just, we're gonna go for it, we're gonna do it. Um, so I'm gonna use this brush, I think, to like put it over the lines. I, whoop, I can't remember what kind I used, but I mixed with something else that was recommended in a YouTube video. There's actually, oh hey, is it Shania? Shania? Am I saying it right? Shania? I'm so glad you're here. Um, someone said to put flour in it to make it thicker. Um, so that might be an option. I might have Kyle bring in some flour. So we're just going to go over right where we put that line and we're going to start putting, and we're going to cut all this up after, okay? Oh wow, look at that. I want to say I mixed it with glycerin. I'm guessing it had some thickening type agent. 
I'll see, I'll see. Um, I'm going to cut this corner too in a second. I'm going to do a couple layers here in the same spot before we move up. Ah, oh, shit. It's like getting all over my desk. <laughs> this is some messy stuff, ladies. I'm going to make sure I don't get it on my laptop. That would be a bummer. So I'm going right over. He was in jello, so it probably, oh, that's awesome. So it probably made it like goopy, like thicker, but you know what I mean? Like, like jello, I guess. Kind of like the fake blood that I have right now currently. I don't want this there. Oh my God, you guys, this is so sticky. We're just gonna snip that right off. Snip that there. Okay. Now, I'm literally scooping this off my desk because <laughs> it totally. Oh my God, Kyle, why are you being so loud? What are you doing? Your what? Oh, they're cut open from the gym? <laughs> Can you guys hear him? Poor guy. He works out a lot and he lifts a lot of weights, so it'll cut open his hands sometimes. So he's in there like washing them and he's like grunting in pain. I'm like, what are you doing? All right, we're gonna snip this a little bit. <laughs> you cutting by your mouth gave me anxiety. I was afraid you would get yourself. <laughs> no, it's like higher than my skin if that makes sense. Okay, I'm gonna have to do this with my, my finger or something. To flatten that out. This is so sticky, you guys, if you've never used this before. Hey, Michaela, so glad you're here. This is the first time I've ever done Halloween makeup like this. So, we're going to learn together. Okay. Then we're going to take this. And I feel like you guys can't... It sucks because the lighting, like, you can't see. I'm just, like, basically making this white and covering this up. But can't wait to see what it comes out like, hon. Thank you. Okay. Um, I brought cotton balls in here too, so, alright, now we're going to start over on this side. One thing that I'm thankful for with this stuff is you don't have to be like perfect with it like that's kind of the whole point the messier the better because it'll look more realistic you know when you get a cut or a wound it's not like a perfect slice right so stick that on And I might actually do one more layer of toilet paper after this dries. Just 
just because. Hey Stacy. Hey Andrea. Okay, again we're gonna go in here and cut by the lip. I don't remember what is the purpose of the toilet paper. Um, we're gonna go over it with like makeup and stuff and it makes it look like skin. It makes it lumpy and it makes it look um, more textured. If you just put the liquid latex on, it would just be like sticky streaks on your face. So this just like adds, I mean you could ultimately, you could just use latex I guess if you made it a little bit thicker um, and just layer it on. But this like helps create that um, look once you put makeup over it. So it looks crazy at first, but um, hey Whitney, as you as you use makeup or yeah, makeup over it, then it what? 140 people? That's insane. I've never had this many people on a live before, you guys. This is so cool. Well, what up, newbies? Hey, Chelsea. Hey, Leslie. Hopefully, you guys are having fun watching me. Because I have never done this before. <laughs> Putting the pressure on. This shit is sticky, you guys. So make sure you're not wearing anything or have anything that you, you know, don't use a brush of value, I guess. <laughs> with any of this. Hey Leslie, Brittany, what's up? Oh, I got a little too long here. We're gonna have to snip off this part. Okay. And yeah, while that dries, I think I am gonna go in over here and add a little bit more on this side. Hey Kayla. And I'm trying not to get it too close to my eye because <laughs> I don't want my eyelashes sticking in anything. So we're going to do another layer here. And I'm going to kind of bring this out a little bit more. On the second layer, I'm going to kind of not do it in such a straight line and like pat it out a little bit more. So when I go over it with the makeup, it'll spread out a little bit, right? Does that make sense? I have to cut up some more toilet paper. Are you guys going to do it to your forehead too? Yeah, up here. Yep. I am. Yes, I am, girl. And we're going to cut into this, too, to, like, open it up and then put stuff on the inside so it really looks like, like an open wound. Get ready for it to feel weird as hell when it's dry, Andrea says. 
I know it's already kind of feeling like weird around my mouth too. I wish you guys could see this because it's totally like the lighting is, I wonder if I should turn this down a little bit. Um, you just peel it off. Super easy. I don't think that really helped you guys. <laughs> the lighting. Whatever. You'll get to see it as I start putting stuff on it. And actually, maybe I'll just do that last layer on the bottom and not the top. Keep the top a little bit thinner so it looks like it's a thicker wound towards the bottom, if that makes any sense. I gotta cut into this one, though, real quick on the bottom. Do I get this one on? Hey, Kayla. Yeah, it wasn't as hard to take off. I practiced on my hand the other day and I was like, oh my God, how am I gonna get this off? And it just peeled right off. It, and it stayed in like one thing. So it was kind of cool actually. It just looked like a piece of rubber. Okay. Hey Bethany. You could, Candace. That's what I was thinking the one night. I was like, excuse me, I don't know if people do this, but I feel like you could totally reuse this. <laughs> this fake wound. I feel like the toilet paper is like splitting up. <laughs> Like, this is not ideal. Whatever, this is gonna look really messy here, but it is what it is. I need more up here too. Oh shit, that was a lot. Now when I go back in with the makeup, I'm still gonna have to like, I don't want it to look like big chunks, you know what I mean? I still want it to look like whatever and then it fades out. So I'm gonna have to like really focus where I'm putting the colors at. Um, if that makes sense, I don't know. I just don't want it to look like one blob of blood. I want it to still look like the lines. All right, now I gotta cut. This does feel weird, Andrea. <laughs> what is an alternative to the toilet paper? Um, I have cotton balls in here. I mean, you really could use anything, I guess. Toilet paper just seems to be the easiest and everybody's got it at home, right? So you don't gotta go out and buy something else. Some people will take the latex and mix it with something else to make it chunkier as they're applying it. But um, I used toilet paper the other night and it seemed to work well for me. So I just figured I would use it again. And I think I'm going to use the cotton balls too um, for the inside of the cuts. All right, so we're going to cut this here. a little bit more watching from the airport awesome Chelsea where are you going again you told me but I forgot 
Paper towels work better than toilet paper, Samantha. You know what? I could probably see that now, um, thinking about it, because, like, like I said, this toilet paper, it keeps splitting. You know, there's, like, two-ply or whatever that is. So that's a little annoying. So that's definitely something to consider for the future. However, I wanted it to, I mean, I guess you could cut toilet, or cut paper towel into small strips. I just wanted it to be smaller strips. Hey, Destiny. Oh, coming home from Washington. Okay, I knew you went somewhere. You told me, but I totally forgot. Did you have a good time? If you can understand what I'm saying. Okay, so now let's do up on top of my forehead, and I have some little snippets here that I probably can just use for that. I don't know if I'll have to cut any more. Heck yeah, but homesick. Yeah, awesome. It works better if you crumble the toilet paper instead of laying it flat. The reason why I laid it flat is just because I wanted the lines to be there. Now I'm going to go back in with the cotton balls and make it more messy, but I just wanted it to be like a line that I could follow. So that was my reasoning behind that. Hey Paige. Okay. Whoa, yeah, it feels really weird around my mouth right now. And I feel like I don't want to, like, laugh or smile because I don't want it to, like, ruin it. Um, because it's definitely still drying. And I don't want to get this in my eyebrow. So I'm trying to be, although this isn't my real brow anyway. This is higher than my real brow, so I still should be good. Blow dry in between layers. I saw that too, but I didn't want to bring a blow dryer in here. So I'm going to do like my contour while I let this dry. And then go back in and add some of the others. I might end up bringing the blow dryer in here though if it becomes too much of a pain in the ass. So what look are you creating? I'm getting a Pennywise type of vibe. Yes, Samantha, that's exactly it. Um, I was Pennywise last night, but I didn't have enough time to use the liquid latex, so this is the first time I've ever used it on my face, like, ever in my life. Um, so I'm a total newbie at this. Um, but I was the girl version of Pennywise, and my husband is being Georgie. And we have, like, the little red balloon, and he made a little, uh, paper, um, boat <laughs> and everything. So I have, like, a girl costume for it, so it's like a dress. Hey Savannah, hey Casey, or is it Cassie? I hope I pronounced that correctly. I always feel bad when I pronounce people's names wrong. I feel like I need to cut these more like this. Although I can use my makeup to make that. I love that my husband hates Halloween and won't dress up. Ah, that sucks. You should just find him, like, the Georgie costume was really simple, though. He just had, he ordered, like, a, um, yellow raincoat off Amazon. So, like, if you just found him something that, like, he didn't really have to do much for and just really convince him, maybe he would. My husband loves Halloween. Like, it's his favorite thing ever. He probably actually loves it more than I do. Um, ooh, crap. Do you have a YouTube channel? Haley, I do. Um, I do, I do. I'm trying to become more active on it. I'm actually a lot more active here on Facebook. Um, but I think I have it linked here somewhere. It should just be the Makeup Maven on YouTube. Thanks, Savannah. I'm doing it again tonight, but I'm. you guys can't even see. Like I'm putting all this crap on my face. <laughs> okay, so while we are... Maybe, wait, I want to do one more layer up here real quick. And then we're going to do, oh my God, for real, you guys? Um, then we're going to do my contour that I did yesterday. 
Yeah, Haley, it should just be the Makeup Maven on YouTube. Or I, I think, like, my technical name is, like, Miranda 2009O. That's, like, my maiden name it used to be an O when I graduated in 2009. I know, super original. I've had the channel for forever, like, before I decided to start posting videos on it. But your best shot on seeing videos for me as of now is going to be here on Facebook. And you can also follow, click the follow button on my personal page. Um, I have so many friend requests right now that I am so overwhelmed. I haven't even gone through them in a long time, like hundreds. And so if you just click the follow button, that's a lot easier for me than going through and accepting everybody's. Um, but my personal page is just Miranda Woodruff. So you guys are more than welcome to follow me there too because I post a lot on there. This is so sticky. What time is it? I gotta start hurrying up. Okay, I'm a new watcher. How huh? I'm interested. Honest, or er, honest. Oh my gosh. Awesome, Haley. <laughs> I feel like I can't talk with this stuff on. I'm glad you're here. I always love connecting with new people. And you guys feel free to share this video or invite your friends to watch. Um, this could turn out really bad. I have no idea. Hey, Cortland. Yesterday turned out decent. Okay. Almost done with this, and then we can start doing our contour that we did yesterday. What's up? Hey, Alicia. Girl, I love you on Victorious. Heather, what's that? I don't even know what that means. Thank you, I think. Did you say, did you see my comment about the dream I had about you? No, I didn't, Chelsea. I don't think I did. Sorry guys, sometimes I miss stuff because I, I'm so focused on this. Or on anything in general. I will miss messages. I miss a lot of stuff. You and... You and Jacqueline Hill could be twins. Oh my God, stop. <laughs> I love you. You look like Jade from Victorious. I don't know what that is, but I'll have to, I'm gonna Google her right now while I'm letting this dry. Hey Julie, hey Caitlin. Okay, I'm looking that up real quick while I'm letting this dry and then we're gonna do our contour. Girl, I'm so dumb, you literally look like Jade off the, <laughs> oh, you thought that I was? You actually thought that I was someone off a TV show. That is so cute. Okay, let's see. Jade Victorious Show. Oh my gosh, she's so cute. Thank you. <laughs> That's like a huge compliment. I love it though. I'll message you about LL. Too much for you to read here. Okay. <laughs> All right. Let's see here. I got this like little piece here that I don't want. Okay. All right, now let's do our contour while we let some of this dry and then we can start getting into the wounds. Ooh, now you can kind of see. See, I just mapped out where I had those. I stopped it right by my eye though because we're gonna wanna blend this out with more makeup. Um, 
So let's get this brush and we used the shade, um, Random question, have you ever used Jeffree Star Liquid Lipsticks? If not, I highly recommend them. Mary, I have not, but I've heard a lot of good things and I definitely want to try them. Um, we're going to use the shade Fervent here for our contour. It's like a burgundy shade. This is a unique pressed palette or pressed eyeshadow shade. So I might have to go over this contour again after I... Oh, shit. Oh, that's not latex, thank God. I thought I got some in my hair. I was about ready to freak out. Um, but yeah, just figured I'd do this while I'm letting this dry. Look up Jade. She has black hair. Yeah, I did just look her up. She's super cute. I've never even heard of that show before. I'll have to check it out. What's it about? Look at these little baby hairs. Hey, Mercedes. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna have to go back in and like blend out this contour, but this is wet, so I don't, I can't fully get in there just yet. What's your, um, Mary, what's your favorite Jeffree Star liquid lipstick? It's a Teen Nick show. My daughter was obsessed. Awesome. Wait till you peel that latex off, girl. Those baby hairs will be gone. Okay. What look are you doing, Gabriella? I am doing my own version of Pennywise the Clown girl version so I did it last night but I didn't use the liquid latex I used a little bit of fake blood but that was it so tonight we're trying this for the first time with liquid latex hi hope what's up yeah my husband's Georgie so that was our I've never done a scary look for Halloween before it's a tie between Red Rum and Designer Blood. I will have to definitely check it out. Hey Mercedes. You guys, when you're here, make sure you comment below. And press the share button, pull a favola. Or invite your friends. There's an option to invite friends to watch. Hey Lindy. I want to watch the movie It, but it looks scary as hell. It's really not bad, Paige. I thought it was adorable, the new one. I like your makeup brushes. Thank you. This is like an Echo Tools angled, I think Echo Tools, angled brush. Hey girl, hey. Hope says you're good at makeup. Thanks girl. I try. I try. All right, I'll be able to blend this out a little bit better once I get, um, once this latex is totally dry. Thank you, Mercedes. You're so sweet. Aristeo Medina, did I pronounce that correct? Hey girl, hey. Hey Shelby. I did see the new movie yet. It was adorable. I loved it. There was like a couple parts that were a little jumpy, but I loved the kids in it. Excited to see how tonight's looks. You did awesome last night. Thank you, Mercedes. Oh, I'm so glad you were on there. We have way more viewers on tonight. It makes me so happy. So happy. I might... Oh, I think I want to add a little bit of brown in this uh, contour. I'm going to take this shade here and add that into my contour too. Maybe I'll do, hold on, instead of this one, I'm going to take like a more um, defined brush, like a smaller, a smaller brush for this. I'm going to go in with this little mini baby. Hey Casey, what's up girl? Okay, so I'm going to take this shade here. I have no idea what it is, but it's a unique pressed shadow. I'm getting hair sticking all over. Okay. And I'm going to define this a little bit more. If you can watch it, then I can to Warrior Girls Power. <laughs> Thanks, Casey. You're so sweet. Thank you so much. I'm going to kind of, and I'm going to blend this out, but I'm going to get in the centers here a little bit more. Alright, let's try to blend that out. We're probably going to redo this again, like I said, once. Ooh, this latex is definitely drying. Thanks, Micah. Oh, thanks, Heather. 
I'll definitely have to check that out. I always get nervous when people say like, oh, you remind me of someone. I'm like, hopefully it's somebody cool <laughs> and not like a jerk or something. Oh, thanks, Paige. I love you. You're so sweet. Can you say hi to Albany, please? She is my four-year-old watching with me. Hi, Albany. How are you, sweetie? My son is obsessed with Pennywise. Super neat. We prefer the original movie, though. You're on point. Thank you, Jessica. You know, honestly, I watched the original one, but it's been years. So if I watched it again, it would seem like it was like brand new to me. So I watched the new one in theaters, but I feel like I want to watch the old one just, just because. It is a classic. Okay. Those brushes are the only kind I use. I love them. I love them too. Hi, Libby. Now I almost feel... Oh, it's starting to dry. It's still a little tacky in some areas though. So you know what? I think we're going to do some eyeshadow right now while we continue to let this dry because I did not bring in a, um, a hair dryer in here, which normally that's probably what you should do. That's what I did in my hand. I just used like a quick blow dryer on it. So let's do some eye makeup first and get that going. And then we can go in with the wounds and really complete it. Hey, Shayla. I see more people hopping on. Make sure you comment below. Toss up some hearts. Nathan, I was just scrolling and seeing this event with you. Makeup, you bad baby. <laughs> hey Nathan, what up? We're trying to become Pennywise the Clown tonight, girl version. So you're seeing in the mix of it all. Hopefully at the end it'll be halfway decent and scary. Thanks, Brittany. Yeah, toss up some hearts, guys. Invite people to watch this. Share, share, share. So far, this has been like my most, um, most people on at one time watching me. So let's see if we can like break a record here. That'd be awesome. Okay, so let's do some eye makeup um, real quick. We're going to do the same one that we did last night. If you were tuned in last night, we just did like a smoky eye. Hey, Shauna. Hey, Hannah. So I'm going to go in with this shade here. Um, this is Gingerly from Unique. And I'm going to use this as a bit of a transition color. Hey, Bonnie. Thank you, Cortland. You guys are awesome. Okay, so I'm going to go in with this. And actually, there's a mirror on this. So I'm just going to use this. And I'm going to do this in my um, crease and a little bit above the crease, too. We want this to be like a nice transition shade for the other colors that we use. Hey, Kendall. You want the Z palette? I got it off Amazon. Isn't it cute? It's got a little mirror and everything. I still got to fill it out more, but hey, Marissa. First time viewer just shared, thank you, Angie, and welcome. I'm so happy to have you here. You guys have no idea how much it means to me when like new people, like when you guys share and spread the word and new people come about and it just like grows, like it makes me so happy. I get so freaking excited. The more the merrier here. Okay. So, hey Ambrosia, um, okay, so we went in with that color, now I think we're going to do, let's see, did we use this one yesterday? I don't know if I, I don't want to use my good brushes. I have so many random brushes. I'm going to use this one again. I mean, these are nice, but they're not that expensive, so it doesn't bother me if something gets screwed up. Okay, um, even though there's really nothing on my eye to screw up anyway, so I guess technically I could still use my own. Now I'm going to go in... I'm going to take a mix of Fervent and this brown color, the same one that we used in our contour. I'm going to do a mix of these shades and I'm going to put that um, in my crease. And above a little bit too.
Can you give a recap of what you have done so far for new joiners like me? Christina, yes. Um, hope, hold on just one second. What my favorite movie is? I don't really know. I love so many. I like when I see people like and comment on your stuff that I know started following you because I told them about you. I'm like, yes, girl. Thank you, Chelsea. Okay, so Christina, for new viewers that are joining in because we're getting a lot of new people, um, what I did so far was I covered my face with like a white base of Halloween makeup, okay? I used some oil um, to even this out, like make it a little easier to blend. Then we covered my eyebrows too. We put my eyebrows on just with a simple black eye pencil. Then I out trace with a lip liner, a unique lip liner, um, where I'm going to put, you can't see this here, but I have little peaks up here too, where I wanted that to be. So I'm doing Pennywise from the movie It. And then once I had that outlined, I went over it with liquid latex and toilet paper. And I'm letting that dry here because I'm going to cut into that and open it up and put some cotton balls in there and put fake blood and stuff and we're going to use makeup to make it look like wounds on my face. And I overdrew my lips and kept this part really wide because I almost wanted to look a little jokerish, right? Um, so basically that's what I did. So we're doing the eye makeup right now while we're letting this dry because um, it was still a little bit tacky. Then we're going to go in with some makeup and scissors and all that good stuff and probably some more latex for the wounds. So we did a look last night that was Pennywise it, but I didn't use any latex because I did not have enough time to dedicate to it. Um, I still need to kind of hurry here too because we got kind of a drive, but we're almost done. Okay, now I'm going to go back in with the same fluffy brush. Hey Madison, and I'm just going to kind of blend those shades together a little bit. I kind of want to, I'm going to dip this into gingerly again and kind of get that up a little bit higher. Hi Alexis. So tell me, what are you guys being for Halloween? What are your plans? Hey Madison. Okay, so now we're gonna go in on the top lid and we're just gonna go in with this black shade here. This is also a unique um, pressed powder. And hey Laura. Alexis, you're not doing anything? Why not, girl? You're not even going to pass out candy to the kids? Oh, they're probably not trick-or-treating yet because technically Halloween's on Tuesday. Hey, Stacey. Okay, so now we're going to go in with this black shade. That's going to be all over the lid. And into our crease as well. But we're not taking this black shade up very high. Think I'm going to be a Snow White. Awesome. Hope I do have a YouTube channel. Hey, Leslie. Um, it should just be the Makeup Maven. I'm more on Facebook Live than I am on YouTube right now, but I'm trying to change that. I'm going to be a barmaid. My husband is going to be a mobster for Halloween. We are going to be going to my niece's party. That's awesome, Paige. That sounds like fun. Hey Kiana, glad to see you hopped back on. I'm new to the video, what look are you going for? Well first off, Julia, welcome. I'm so glad that you're here. Um, I am doing my own version of Pennywise the Clown um, from the movie It. So I did a look last night, a live look, but I didn't use liquid latex. Um, so my husband is Georgie. And this is my first time ever using liquid latex. Um, and actually my, my first year of Halloween ever doing a scary look in general. So welcome and I hope you enjoy watching the process. <laughs> um, 
My daughter's obsessed with watching your live. She asks for your videos all the time now. Oh my gosh, Stacy, that's so cute. I'm doing nothing for Halloween. Aw, oh, that sucks, Alexis. Thank you, Julia. Yeah, I'm excited to see how it turns out tonight with the um the liquid latex. My whole goal with the liquid latex was to make it look like wounds here, you know, where he's got like the smile. Um so we'll see how it turns out. I'm just taking this fervent shade again, this like reddish shade, and kind of re-going over this area a little bit. And then I'm gonna blend that out with a fluffy brush. Halloween and Christmas are my faves. Yeah, I love Christmas too. We need to get a new Christmas tree this year because our old Christmas tree got destroyed in the flood, which was really sucked. Um, but yeah, I love Christmas. Bye Hope, thanks for tuning in. I get to work like always, but we're having little kids come over and trick or treat at our residence and passing out candy. That's fun, Madison. We're gonna do the same thing. Chelsea's smile. Yeah, we, um, excuse me, I totally just burped. Um, <laughs> we are dressing up our dogs too. They're gonna be little pumpkins. So, they're gonna be with us tonight too, so I'll probably take pictures of them. And then they're gonna pass out candy with us during the week. That's what it's called when a face is caught like that. Oh, okay, Candace. I was like, wait, what is she talking about? What does that mean? Okay, so now we'll do, let's see, this is almost done drying. It's fairly dry. I'm going to do the bottom part of my eye though. So last night I went in with all black here as well. And we lined the waterline all. Oh, I'm missing comments. We have um, Shelty Shih Tzu mixes, so they're super cute. I love them. My partner is in the hol is in the holiday. Is coming back on the eighth of November. Awesome! That's so awesome. Oh, I'm missing out on the comments on this side. Hey Heather, I'm excited for Wednesday to put my tree up. <laughs> oh my gosh, Mary, that's so funny. Yeah, we're gonna um, we'll probably put it up after Thanksgiving, the day after Thanksgiving. Well, we gotta go get one, so we'll go buy one. Maybe on Black a Black Friday sale, hopefully we can find a good deal. Oh my gosh, I cannot wait to see your dogs in pumpkin costumes, thank you. Hey Heather. Yeah. They're actually like children's costumes that I got on sale last year at the end of the season. And they're little like sparkly orange skirts. And then they have like matching sparkly orange. Like it should go on like a kid's head and it's got a little green. But I'm going to put it around their neck. <laughs> I'm that dog mom. Yes I am. We don't have any kids yet. So our dogs are our children. Okay now I'm going to go in with that fervent color. Hey Heather. So I'm going in with this fervent color and I'm going over both the red and the black and I'm starting to kind of smudge that together. Romeo, Michigan, I guess it's an awesome place to go. People decorate their houses like crazy. Liliana is Dorothy from Wizard of Oz, and Axel is... Darn it, it cut it off. I can't read the rest of that. Hey, Brooke. I'll have to check that out, though, because I'm from Michigan, so... I've never... I've never heard of that. That's really cool, though. I always loved, as a kid, um, driving around and finding, like, neighborhoods with all the Christmas lights and stuff. We used to do that a lot. We would just get in the car and like drive around and go look at Christmas lights. Did anybody else do that? Hey Becca. Where are you from by the way? I'm watching from Cali. Ooh, Casey's from Cali. I've never been to Cali. I've always wanted to go. I am from Michigan. I 
unfortunately live in I don't want to say unfortunately because I love our falls like right now is my favorite time of year but then when winter comes girl get out I can't I'm I know <laughs> that's what my mom and I do on Christmas Eve oh that's so fun I can't wait to like once we start having a family um to have those little traditions with them or go to like Frankenmuth who here goes to Frankenmuth Hey, Abby. I'm glad to see that you tuned back in. Watching from South Dakota, and it's already snowing. What, Caitlin? No. Mom and Dad used to take us when we were very small. Me, I love it there. <laughs> okay. So now that we got this dry, um, Kelly is not the best. Everyone wishes to come here, but it's always so dang hot. I bet that's okay, Ab. Um, oh, you used to live in Frankenmuth, Teresa? That's awesome. Um, I bet, like, I always wonder, like, people who live in tropical locations, like, do they get sick of it? You know, like Florida and stuff. Um, okay. Seems like it's pretty decent to go, so we're going to start cutting into this and filling it with ripped up um, cotton balls. We're going to see how this goes. I'm in Ohio and I woke up to snow this morning. I'm actually going to Michigan Monday. What, Samantha? No, don't tell me that. I don't want snow yet. Alexis, I'm really sorry. Samantha, you love Michigan. I do love the seasons, um, but just not winter, and winter seems to be the longest one. Okay, so I'm ripping up just random pieces of this cotton ball. And we're going to use this in a second because we're going to cut into these wounds. And we're going to add some texture in here and then some fake blood and some makeup. And we're going to just make this look really nasty. Hey, Brianna. Hey, Erin. I heard Owasa was supposed to get snow tomorrow. No. <laughs> yes, I want to go to Colorado. It's always cold there. Girl, come to Michigan because <laughs> it's always cold here too, it seems like. We have decent summers, but hey, Lindsay. All right, so I'm just going to go for it. We're going to start right down here. Ooh, girl, yes, I'm all about this SFX creepy realness. Thank you. Me and Simon Foster are engaged. Awesome, Alexis. Congrats, girl. We had our wedding last fall, and it was the best day ever. I'm so glad I don't have to plan it anymore, though. Okay, so we did our first slice. I don't know if you guys can see this because the lighting sucks. Hey Lauren, hey Molly. Thank you, girl. So we just did our first slice and I'm gonna peel some of this back. Gotta like get out, thank God for these long nails right now, right? Gotta peel some of this up. Peel it back. You're due February 21st. Awesome, Teresa. Congrats. Hey, Cinda. All right, so we just opened this up. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to put some more latex in there. Surprise, surprise. Okay. I wish I had time and more importantly the skill to do this stuff. I love it. Thank you, Hallie.
All right, so I'm filling this with some liquid latex and then I'm gonna go in. Oh shit, sorry guys. Dropping stuff all over. I'm trying to like keep this on here so it doesn't get <coughs> liquid latex all over. I'm gonna fill this with some cotton ball pieces. Give it a little more. Oh, I wish you guys could see this. Like the lighting is just like totally, for those of you who are still here, like you're a trooper, cause I realize it's hard to see right now until I start painting this up. So I appreciate you. Okay, got that in there. And I want it a little more open right here. I want the mouth to look really nasty. Can you dim the light a little more? I can try, but I feel like it just, oh wait, does that help? Does that help a little bit more, you guys? Hey, Maria. Tell me if that's better. Yay! I'm so glad. Oh my god, this is so sticky. My two-year-old keeps saying hi, but you obviously can't hear her, so will you say hello to my daughter, Aaliyah? Hi, Aaliyah! Hi, sweetie! Do you know other ways to use this without the latex? I'm allergic to latex. Um, you should watch my video from last night, Casey, because I did it just all with makeup. I didn't use latex at all. I don't personally know another concoction for, like, fake latex or whatever, but I'm sure there's something out there. I would just get on YouTube. Um... Cause I don't know what sticks you know this well. I'm so glad I have a life proof case because I've got you in the shower with me. I'm not missing this. Oh my God, I love you. <sighs> wax, okay Lindsay, Lindsay knows. Wax girl, try wax. Thank you, she was so happy. Oh, that's so cute, Natasha. Okay, so now we're gonna cut this side. Can you guys hear that loud ass music that my husband is blaring? He clearly doesn't get a Facebook jail. Like that's so loud. Okay. So now let's try to Babe, can you turn that down? Kyle! Kyle! What? Can you turn that down because they can hear it on here and I'm afraid of Facebook jail. <laughs> it is a good song. He is jamming with the paper boat out there. I don't mean to be like the party pooper, but I've gone into Facebook jail way too many times. Nope, that was from Kyle. Okay, now we're gonna go back in with this liquid latex. Yeah, this this brush is destroyed. It's alright though, it was cheap. Take this cotton ball. Cut it. They're oddly doing a tribute to Chester, the lead singer of that band tonight, are they? Yeah, Casey, Facebook Jail is if you use any type of music in your videos, 
um, they'll ban you from going live for like X amount of time. They don't even tell you usually. I haven't been able, there are times where I wasn't able to go live for like 10 days straight. And all because I had my radio playing in the background. So it's like a copyright thing. I don't know. Oh my god, you're just starting and I'm freaking out. I can't wait for the finish left. Thank you. I think once I get the fake blood in here and the makeup. This side looks a little more than this side, but whatever. What wounds are even? They aren't. Okay. Now, hey Amy, we're gonna go up. We gonna go up, girl. I wish I could have music on. I used to have music on. Can you say hi, Skyla? Hi, Skyla. What up, girl? Hey, Heather. Hey, Adela. Okay, so now this I made a little thinner. So this isn't gonna be as intense as this cut here. Um, so we're just gonna kind of go with it and see what happens. What up, Cassie? If I can even get in there, it might be too close to my actual skin. We might just have to fake this one. Hi, Hazia. What's up, girl? You guys doing anything fun for Halloween tonight? I'm afraid I'm going to stab my own damn cheek. There's going to be real blood. Yeah, this one might be too thin, you guys. Oh, no. No, I think I can do it. Oh, I can do it. There we go. There we go. Got it, boo. Yes. Okay. Now we're gonna open that up. I had to leave for a little while. My son had a friend over and they were getting ready to leave. I was afraid I would miss the whole thing. My boyfriend and I are carving pumpkins tonight. Talk about anxiety, Candace says. <laughs> Watching scary movies. That's always a fun thing. We love scary movies. We go to the movie theater usually every Sunday. If not the theater, then we rent something at home. We're huge movie people. And Kyle loves scary movies. Open that up. Yes, girl, love the makeup. I'm doing Halloween makeup for my friends' kids all weekend. Awesome, Megan, that sounds like fun. You're freaking me out doing that up towards your eye. I know, I had to be very careful. I was kind of nervous for myself, so we're just gonna leave it at this and then we're gonna like play with makeup on the other part so I don't have to get that close to my freaking eyeball. All right, so we're gonna take some more latex, put that in there. I wouldn't be able to do that. I would have stabbed myself in the eyes by now. Makeup is looking great though, loving it. Thanks, boo. All right, we're gonna put this ripped up cotton ball in there. Do the same thing on this side. I'm wondering if I'm going to be able to cut open the tops near my eyebrows because those are really thin. But we'll see. I should be able to. The thicker the better with this stuff, you guys. The more you can layer shit on, the better. Hey Stephanie, you guys when you're here, toss up some hearts, comment below, keep sharing too, we've had quite a great audience on tonight, and I'm surprised so many of you have stayed on 
this whole time too. Thank you. This being my first time doing something like this. But I'm having fun with it. I honestly wouldn't mind doing this even not on Halloween. Does that itch? No, it really doesn't. It really doesn't. It feels sticky. When it dries, it feels tighter. I want to see what it's going to look like, Cindy says. <laughs> okay. Let's do up here on the eyebrow area. part was going to be hard because this is really close to my skin. There we go. I play with liquid latex all year long. My little brat loves it. You're more chipper today. <laughs> yeah, Jenny, I am. <laughs> I definitely am. Sorry, guys. Yesterday I was just so crabby. I was, like I said, I was running on like three hours of sleep. Just woke up from a nap. I felt like I was just rushed. And really I do need to hurry. But we're literally almost done. Like this is the hardest part of this. Um, Cinda, I just like the movie It is like really popular right now. And I just wanted to do something scary. So I don't know. I know he has these lines on his face. And I was like wouldn't it be cool if it looked like they were slashed open. Like somebody cut them. And so then I just got the idea to try it out. Why not? Said it could turn out really bad and then we could just all laugh at it together or it could look pretty sweet. And then I could try doing this more often. Because I feel like I always do the same looks, you guys. I always do like the same pretty makeup every day. So I just wanted to get out of my comfort zone. I feel like that's the best way to grow as a person. And grow and I mean obviously well I shouldn't say everyone because a lot of you are new here hey Tasia hey Heather um, this is my job like this is my full-time job I work from home I run a beauty business I run an online boutique so um, my beauty business is really what catapulted me into being able to do my online boutique and stuff and um, I'm just always looking for new ways to be creative and keep it going hey Ashley you guys, when you're here, toss up some hearts, comment below, let me know where you're tuning in from. Let me know if you follow my page or not. Okay. Got a lot of newbies here tonight. <laughs> Will you say hi, Abby? Hi, Abby. <laughs> hi, Abby. Oklahoma from Brooke. Sweet girl. I've only been through Oklahoma. I've never actually been to Oklahoma, but I've driven through it before. That didn't work out that great on my top. Hey, can't wait to see. Whoop. Can you not see my comments, AJ? No, I didn't. Oh, Kansas. Sorry, I'm missing some comments, you guys. If I miss them, it's not because I'm trying to. Texas, Bay City, Ontario. Look at you guys. <laughs> Warner Street, Abby. <laughs> okay. So, now we can start playing with the fake blood in the makeup and trying to see if we can make this look a little freaky. So, I kind of want to go in. What do I want to do first? I think I'm going to go over it with makeup first and then fill the insides. Hey, Mandy. Um, okay. Oh, and my, hold on, my laptop is about ready to die. Caribbean, girl! I'm jealous. I need to plug in my laptop. Okay, there we go. Alright, I got a whole mess here. Regina, Saskatchewan. That is in Canada, correct? Am I right? Am I wrong? Owasso, Alger. Okay. So 
So how do I want to do this? I think I'm going to start taking those same colors. I think I'm going to do some brown at first. I'm going to use this like brownish shade here. Hey Ashley. I'm trying to hurry up Ash so we can semi be there on time. And I'm going to start fading it out here. We're going to blend that out, but no shout out to Elger. I said Elger. <laughs> hey, Kayla, you are so good at doing makeup. Thank you. Kelly, Kelly, Kelly. <laughs> Shut up, Abby. I can I know that you're sitting there laughing right now you and Dana Dana's probably still over and you guys are probably just sitting there laughing mm -hmm. hey Kayla hey Courtney Yep, she says. I know you guys. Holy cow, you have transferred a bit since I left. Yes, I have. I know it. I can hear your guys' laughs right now in my head. Do you have the whole costume to go with the makeup? Yes, I do, Ashley. Yep. Um, I did this look last night too, but I just didn't use the liquid latex. So it's like a dress. It's like a girl version of it. So it doesn't look like the movie really, but, um, like my own take on it, I guess. We're going to blend this out too, because I don't want this to look like such harsh freaking lines. Actually, let me take this brush again. I need to be laughing. We had to get Dorothy put to sleep suddenly. What? What? Abby, stop. That's not funny if that's a joke. Are you for real right now? Like, you guys, that's Abby's dog. Seriously? Oh my god. I'm so sorry. I Wow, because I literally went live like right after we got off the phone, I feel. So that must have like just happened. My dad called me right after. Oh my God. Abby, I'm so sorry. That is awful. I can't even imagine what you must be feeling like right now. Ugh, that makes me sick. I feel like I want to cry right now. I'm just kind of smudging this out. God, I feel so awful. I've been on here. I didn't even know. We'll have to talk later and you'll have to tell me what happened. Thanks, Danielle. Does anyone want to make... <laughs> Courtney, like, really? Really? You're going to do that? Homegirl, I work online too, but I don't spam people's videos with that shit. That is the worst pain ever. We've had three animals pass away in the last few months. It was very hard. I'm so sorry. I know, I need to block that girl. How do I block this girl? Courtney. 
like Courtney I'm hiding your comment and like you're not welcome here bye <laughs> like are you I don't understand people like okay <laughs> Abby I want the money uh um so for those of you who are new to this page because there's so many new people on here tonight I am a unique presenter okay and I get it I get it that like there's so many people out there that are like so turned off by network marketing and they hate it because they're spammers like that girl who just did what she just did on my live. I think that's bullshit and I will never do that to someone like if you want to buy makeup for me you know where to get it. You're here hanging out with me you know that I got the hookup if you don't I don't care you know what I mean like that's all on you and I feel like that's the way that it should be but unfortunately you have spammers like that who just make themselves and the whole industry look bad and it pisses me off. Thank you, Stacey. I'm glad that you like them. Courtney, I um I hid them because nobody needs to see that. You're not going to spam my friends on my video with your bullshit. Bye. Like, if that makes me a bitch, whatever. I do the same freaking thing and I would never do that to someone. That's so disrespectful. To get on my live, my business page, and try to sell someone some whatever the hell you're doing which I'm glad that it changed your life but no go away <laughs> I will freak out and that's coming from someone who does work online like get out of here with your bullshit I need to message you because I want the hookup girl I will I can hook you up with some sweet makeup but I can't wear my glasses when I use them because they make my lashes so long. They do. Have you tried the new Epic Mascara, Stacey? If you haven't, you should totally try it. Because I, I personally love it more than the 3D. Just because I feel like it's more um, something you can wear every day. But it still gives you like a really good like length and fullness and all that good stuff. I'm so sorry, Abby. I had to let my oldest fur baby go this last January. It's so hard. I miss him every day, but try to remember he will. Oh, it got cut off. I'm sorry you lost your puppy too. Stacy girl, you know that I can hook you up. Just let me know. Okay. I'm going to try to outline these up here a little bit. So I'm going to put... This brown here. Yeah, we had a cat that we rescued, um, and we only knew him for two weeks, and he ended up being really sick, and we had to put him down, and it was so hard. So I can't imagine having to put down an animal that you had for such a long time like that's really really hard hey India so on this page Stacy there is a shop now button so you can click that um you can also always message me I don't know how available I'm going to be tonight because we're going to be busy, but I always answer back as soon as I'm available. I just missed that. Your makeup is so creepy. I've never seen the movie, so it's just woe to me, insanely good, and you haven't even gotten to the blood. Thank you, Courtney. So are you just outlining with eyeshadow? Yes. Um, Courtney, that's fine, but just take that as a lesson. Take it as a lesson because it's not cool to do. Like, go do it somewhere else. Do it on your own page. Like... You need to make relationships with people, okay? You don't need to do that to strangers. It's not okay. Um, it's never okay. Go make your own relationships. Go do your own live, okay? And if people are interested, they'll hop on, right? That's what it's all about. 
but it's not going to happen here because you'll get blocked. Um, yeah, I'm just outlining with that first and then I'm going to add the blood in second. And then we're going to do the lips a different color because it needs to be like more dark. Sorry guys if I sound like bitchy to that girl, but like that's the truth. And if somebody's got to obviously tell her because she doesn't know. So I just told you. <clears throat> we're going to fix this contour a little bit too because these are like down here. So the contour kind of needs to like match up with that a little bit. There we go. Okay, now let's try to do this fake blood and see if we can make this look good. We might have to add some more um, shadow or something. Or maybe we should do, yeah, we'll do the blood and then we'll do the lips. Okay, so for this, I'm going to take this little guy for the blood. This stuff is chunky. Actually, I think I'm just going to apply directly. This is like a, it looks like a little lip gloss thing. I hope I'm not. Missing comments. Thanks, Kayla. I am. See, I'm missing comments now. Ashley, um, I don't sell these. No, I got these off Amazon. I do have brushes that I do sell, though. So if you're interested, um, you know what I'll do? Thanks, Jen. I'm going to quickly, um, just for those of you, because some of the products that I use tonight are the products that I do sell. Um, so hold on. Shameless plug. <laughs> um, the Makeup Maven... Oops, if I can spell Maven dot shop. That's where you guys can go look. And obviously, like I said, um, if you guys, um, how do I pin that pin? Okay. So I pin that there for you guys. If you guys have any questions, like feel free to message me and I can help you. Hey, Courtney. Hey, Olivia. Okay. Let's get this fake blood on there. This stuff is thick. You're starting to look super creepy. Oh, I already read that. Sorry, I'm just trying to make sure that I'm not missing anything. Hey, Hope. Because it's not popping up on my um, phone anymore. Thanks, Leah. You're so sweet. You guys, sorry if I um, missed any comments. And Hope, that's okay. I realize my lives are long, so not everybody can like hang out the whole time. So I'm appreciative for those of you who have stuck it out this whole time. All right. gonna be all over my freaking hands do you have a bunch of people asking you to do their makeup for Halloween 
this is the first time I've ever done Halloween makeup like this, so I really haven't. Thanks, Candace. Thanks, Mariah. Thanks, Kayla. I'm almost done, babe. How are you liking it? Scary. Does it look better than last night? Yeah. You said this thing started at 6. Yeah, but my mom said we could get there anytime. Well, you didn't tell me that yesterday. Yes, I did. <gasps> oh, dude. See, he's always like on me about time. We get there when we get there, right? Who's with me? I, if you are friends with me, or you become friends with me, or we ever make plans to hang out, I will always be late. Like, always at least 15 to 20 minutes late. So if you're someone who gets offended by that, you're going to get offended by me. Because I'm never on time, so I'm just giving you the forewarning. It's never going to happen. Um, I'm just always late. Dude, came back on and holy shit, that looks so scary. Thank you. I'm offended. <laughs> same girl, same. I'm late, if not 20 minutes early type of person. I actually get offended when people come early. Like, okay, this is so crazy, but for, we hosted um, Easter here at our house for the first time. And I told my parents to be here like at a certain time. And they showed up like 30 minutes early and I was not ready and I cried. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I'm an emotional person. So I was like, wait, why are you here? I'm not ready. And my mom was like, oh, I'm sorry, we can leave. And I said, no, it's fine. You're here already. And I just was like, I wanted it to be perfect when you got here and I'm not prepared. And <laughs> it was ridiculous. I'm always painfully early. For all the times I've had to be on dotty time. Do you have an outfit you're wearing with this? Yes, I do. Um, I will post pictures with it. It's like a dress, like with a tutu and stuff. Um, okay, I feel like this needs to be blended a little bit better. I think I'm going to go in with, this is all over my hands, by the way, but it's all good. I'm going to go in again with this, um, fervent shade here. And kind of blend that into the blood. And get all the spots of the latex that aren't covered. So it's like not as fine of um, lines as I wanted, but whatever. It's kind of hard to make it a fine line. And we got to get these lips a different shade too because this is too bright of red. Oh, and this is popping off here. We might, we might need a little more latex there. Why isn't your hubby reading your comments to you? Because <laughs> he's getting ready in the other room. And I have my laptop here. So I think I can handle it. Okay, now we're going to go in with... Hey, babe, can you bring me my purse real quick, please? It's got the other lip color that I need. So we're going to go in with, um, this is Unique Splash Liquid Lipstick in the shade Sizzling. We're going to do this first, and then we're going to cover it with Stoic to give it, like, that darker red color. Because I don't want it to be, like, bright red. Um, my... Hold on, I want to make sure that I'm caught up on here. I feel like I'm missing so much. Oh, thanks, Brooke. Okay, now I'm seeing some more comments. All right. We are gonna... Oh, and we gotta do the nose, too.
Hey, Carly. I'm really overdrawing my lips right now, too. Remember your lips on an app on the outside. Yeah, I think that's a good idea. That's what I'll do with the next color. Try to keep the centers a little bit lighter. It's a good idea, Ashley. Hey, Alexa. Thanks, Cindy. Thank you so much. Babe. Kyle. Do you love it, Carly? Kyle. What? Purse, please. Oh, wait, it's in here. Yeah, Sorry. I I Just kidding. I didn't hear you say that. Damn, Jackie. I can't hear you if you whisper under your freaking breath from another room. Speak up. Okay. So now we're going to go in with... <laughs> Did you guys get my damn Jackie reference? Who here watched that 70s show? <laughs> um, hold on. Where is it? I know I brought this with me last night. Yes. Yes. Okay. So this is unique splash liquid lipstick in the shade Stoic. So this is like a rusty, rusty brown shade. And I'm going to ombre it at first, like Ashley said, and see if I like it. And then if I don't, then I'll just do it all over. Try to ombre this into the blood. Tell him to stop being a turd and <laughs> love the damn Jackie. <laughs> yeah, he like must have whispered his response back to me because I literally never heard him. He's like, I told you that. Should I leave it? Hey, Skyla. Should I do the ombre, you guys, or should I do the whole lip in Stoic? What's your opinion? Actually, I'm going to take Stoic and kind of put it, dab it in these areas. I'll probably put some sizzling in there, too. You like the ombre? Leave it, ombre from the outside in towards your mouth. So you think I should do it, wait, like you like it like this? I like the ombre, everyone's saying ombre. Okay. I'll leave it. That was a good idea, Ashley, look at you girl. Brought it all together for me. more in the middle It looks like fresh blood meat. Thank you. Thanks, Mary.
fresh blood. Once you have your nose on it, it will bring it together. Yes, very true. You guys are right. Look at you. Helping me out. Okay. I'm going to take a little bit of the sizzling too and kind of mix a little red because I feel like it's looking a little brown. We're going to do some brighter red in certain areas. Hi, Phil. <laughs> Abby, you're making me laugh. You guys, my friends get weirded out that um, there are like people on here that, I hate to say it like this, this sounds so whatever, but like my sister, for instance, like her one friend has a sister that's in school and her, her little sister or whatever, or cousin was like, oh my God, that's so cool you know someone whose sister is famous. Like they think that I'm like, like famous or something cause they see me on Facebook, which I'm totally not. But my friends always get re really weirded out cause like, you know, they know me and they're like, oh my God, like these people are like freaking out over you. And it's just funny. Hi, Kimberly. The brown actually looks cool and it makes it seem like an old gash that never healed. I think adding a little bit of the red though just kind of makes it pop. I don't want too much red, but because I definitely agree with that and I like the brown. But I want to add just like a teeny bit, just a little pop because the red's going to be on my nose. So, and it's obviously on my lips. Okay, so now we're going to do the nose. When you look down to do your makeup, it looks just like him. Does it really? And I'll get my little red bloom. These are like not even though. <laughs> oh well, whatever. It is what it is. Um, I actually feel like I need to take this brow out a little bit more. Yes, the little bit of red makes it look real. The brown, oh, I already read that. Sorry. Okay, what was I doing next? My nose, my nose, okay. So now, we're gonna drop all of our shit on the floor and crawl around to get it. Um, okay, we have our primal lip liner and we're going to it's like red on the top that she had and more black on the bottom is what I did yesterday. Creeping me out when you raise your eyebrows and look down. They don't need to be even. Being uneven makes it creepier. <laughs> then again, I hate clowns. <laughs> okay. Um, my nose. That's what I'm doing. My nose. Use this as like the base and then we're gonna go over it you guys I keep burping like this whole video I have been burping <laughs> that's so weird because I wasn't even drinking anything other than water Okay, now we're going to take some of that black and we need to sharpen this real quick. Raise your hand if you've been here the whole time. Let me know because you're the real MVP. Just sit with me through all this.
Hey Savannah. Kiana's been here the whole time. Andrea's been here the whole time. Jennifer's been here the whole time. Kristen. Abby. Yeah, Kristen took me in the freaking shower. <laughs> She's really dedicated. Dana's been here the whole time. Brooke. Miriam. You guys are awesome. JK. This is Dana. Rude. Alright, I'm gonna like smudge this down. Kind of smudge these together. And then we're gonna take some red. Holly. Sizzling liquid lipstick. And we're gonna mix Stoic over it. That rusty brown. Ooh, I got a lot there. I think I need a little more. Will you take, will it take you this long to take it all off after? No. Christina, it's really not that hard. Woo. Um, all I have to do is just, like, this will all peel off. And then just, like, regular, like, you would, I mean, it might take, like, a little extra than normal. Um, Amber, I'm going to put my hair in pigtails like I did last night. And I'm going to spray them red. Or spray my hair red. You should go live when you take it all off. <laughs> if I am home because my parents don't get good service out there so um if I have good enough service or we end up we're at home when I do it um then heck yeah girl I can show you what it looks like taking that latex off all right now let's do some mascara I'm going to use my unique epic mascara So, for those of you who watched last night or saw last night's look compared to tonight, which one do you like better and why? Thanks, Christine. This, more realistic, says Stacy. This one looks like the real deal. Woo. This one, the latex makes it look better and more realistic. This one. I like them both, but this one adds a little more depth and detail. This, it's so creepy. Awesome, you guys. Thank you, Nikki. Thank you, Kayla, Lindsay, Kayla, everybody. I'm so glad that you like it. Last night, I wouldn't have shit myself if I saw you. Tonight, I would have. <laughs> I'm going to do another boomerang where I'm doing his dance, too, with this, with this look. And you know what? I think I'm going to do, for a little extra detail, I'm going to put a little blood, like, dripping down right here. Both are really cool. Thank you, Kiana. Okay, I'm going to take, put some on this brush here, and I'm going to put that right there. This looks more real, so that clowns are way creepy, and I can barely look at you. <laughs> Good. Because that's going to be my job tonight. 
creeping these kids out. They're going to be late, but maybe that'll be better that I'm late so I can show up so they won't know that I'm there. And then they'll be like super creeped out. Be like, who's that? You would scare the crap out of me if I seen you walk in the door. I know, Mom. My mom's on here. We want to see you soon. <laughs> Sorry, we're going to be late. Um, <laughs> but I'm basically done here. So I just got to put my hair up, spray on it, and put my costume on. And then we're going to be leaving. Kyle doesn't really have any get ready process. So what do you think, Mom? Am I going to scare the kids? Ha, huh, Kim. She's always late. <laughs> All right, guys. Well, I will post pictures once I get my costume on. I'm going to add a little bit of blood, like, down my neck and stuff. Um, and I'll have my hair in pigtails. So, and I'm going to spray it red. So this is the finished look. Um, if you guys tuned in this whole time, thank you. This is my first time using liquid latex on my face. Um, I was really scared and nervous to do this live because I didn't know how it would turn out. But I'm pretty happy with it. I think it looks pretty sweet. I think I'll scare the kids tonight. I can't wait to take like a final picture and show you guys. So I love you and for all of you who are new that hopped on tonight, thank you so much and welcome. I hope that you guys tune in for more of my lives. I will try to go live when I take this off, um, but I'm actually on a live right now, like a 90 day challenge. So I try to go live every day. Sometimes I miss, but um, yeah, so I hope that you guys tune in with me. Hop on over to my personal page too, Miranda Woodruff, and click the follow button so you can keep up with my life um, and everything going on. So I love you guys. I hope that you have a great night. Enjoy your Halloween festivities, and I will chat at you later. Bye.